the last part in this build series on the Dyna. And what it is is a fork brace. And um, yeah, the company I got it from is called Death Suppliers. I believe they kind of, um, I don't know if they're one off for that company or if they're mass produced, but they look uh, very similar to a bunch of different companies that make them. Um, I've done a little bit of research. Some say they don't work, some say they do. Um, I've always wanted to try one out and, and test it and see, because they're only about 150 bucks, um, you know, for the, for the cheaper ones. So um, they do say that they do help out with the extended forks, um, which, which this is extended forks. Um, we did the two plus tracker die dampeners in here. And yeah, so we got the dyno up on the lift and we got the suspension all the way out. And we got everything laid out uh, over there for the install. So let's check out the parts that we got. So this is actually the fork brace and it, it separates so you don't have to pull the um, tubes out or anything. There's, there's Allen's in here and then Allen's up here. And it looks like it's like perforated, so it will grab on here like so. So um, what we'll do is I think I'm going to pull these apart, put a dab of Loctite in there, and then kind of, you know, finger tight everything on the bike and, you know, see where these goes. I believe they go um, on the actual fork lowers themselves um, below the dust gap. So... You know that's a trial trial and error thing it, you know there's no instructions with these things i couldn't find any pictures online of this particular company so so yeah let's get everything um torn apart here and we'll get a little dab of loctite on everything and we'll mock it up on the bike finger tight and go from there <laughs> So that's it guys, super easy install. Um, you know, like I said, all you gotta do is kinda do everything loose um, by hand, you know, make sure everything fits. But yeah, I could, in the video, you'll see, I kinda tightened everything here on the inside, then slid down and then did these end caps. And you just wanna make sure you tighten, you know, each side evenly, that way it goes on there. But um, yeah, um, hopefully it works. <laughs> If not, it looks pretty cool, I guess, for a hundred bucks. So uh, we'll do a review video on it and see if we stiffened up the front end of the Dyna any. So appreciate this support, guys. Like, comment, and subscribe. Happy New Year, and we'll see you on the next one. Take it easy.